Hello everyone, please welcome and join me in Seps Cooking. Today I'm going to share with you I tuna fish and I'm going to make it on my griddle and how do I make it tasty and delicious that I'm going to share with you. This is the fish I'm going to use. It's called I like a high I tuna. I'm going to get a big pot. I'm going to marinate I tuna, please check it out the description below for all the ingredient list. I have a nice five pieces big steak. I'm going to place it in the pot. I'm going to use store bought lemon pepper. I'm going to use a deggy mirch. I'm going to use a ground ginger. Two tablespoons lemon pepper. Ground ginger, one teaspoon. One tablespoon, deggy milk. Black pepper, one tablespoon. Garam masala, one teaspoon. Grinder powder, one teaspoon. Cumin powder, one teaspoon. Salt to taste, but I'm going to use two teaspoons. As a personal hygiene, your hand should be washed and clean. So I'm going to make sure that, first I'm going to place it so we're going to make sure that it's nicely coated. This is all dry masala. So we're going to make sure that we pat it. Our eye tuna is marinated nicely and I'm going to let it sit on the countertop for half an hour. I have my griddle laying out on two burners and I'm going to start it. And I'm going to turn the fan on. And I'm going to use olive oil, and that is the spray. Even uh, you can use any vegetable oil. If you have a brush, you can brush them off. So I'm just going to spray a little bit. That's good enough. Our fish, I tuna, steaks are marinated for half an hour, and I'm going to place it on top. After placing these I tuna steak, I'm going to cook three minutes on this side. Then the color will start changing. It's gonna be start cooking. After exactly three minutes later, I'm going to turn them over. And I'm going to keep my gas high. Cooking our I tuna steak for three minutes, I'm going to turn them over. I'm going to scrape on my girdle. And then I'm going to turn them over. And now I'm going to bring the gas on medium. As the tuna steaks is cooking, the color start changing. It is changing to light color. That means it's cooking. Since we added the dry spices, it got burned, they're going to fall off. So nothing to worry, that's not a major or it's alarming. Another three minutes of cooking on medium flame, I do not say. I'm going to bring the gas to low, the griddle is hot, and now I'm going to turn them over. Look at this, so nice. Now in the low flame, I'm going to cook one more minute on this side, then after that I'm going to put it on the side like this. So it can cook from the sides as well, because the steaks are really big. They are big in size, so I will place it like this, right in the middle of the griddle. So I'm going to do it to turn the sides over so there are three sides so within three minutes it will be done then I'll take it out. I'm going to taste it. Wow, these are big. Look at this. It's really nicely cooked. It's really nicely cooked. 
Mm. Very tasty. Very mild flavor and I like it. And let me close it. Ahi tuna steaks are ready. They are grilled. They are very tasty and very delicious. Please try it and you're going to like it. Like always, like, subscribe and share Easy Steps Cooking. Thank you. Bye-bye.